Hello children, this is Miss Betty and I am missing you all so much. The teachers are missing you and we wish that we could be together again soon. I hope that that can happen, but until we can, I hope you're enjoying spending time with your families and I am going to be reading some awesome stories to you and singing some songs with you. So let's get started. The first song is going to be, I'm so glad that you're all right today. I'm so glad that you're all right today. Sing with me. I'm so glad that you're all right today. Hip, 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 hooray. Now the first story is one of my favorite stories. I'm going to read it to you right now, but let me get my glasses so I can see. It is called Sam and the Firefly. And the author and the illustrator is P. D. Eastman. Are you ready? Sit on your bottoms, close your sounds, and let's get ready to read. The moon was up when Sam came out. Now is the time to play. Who said Sam who? Who wants to play? But no one said a thing. Then Sam looked about. The fox was asleep. You see the fox? Let me see, where's the fox? Where are you, fox? I think the fox is right here. Can you see the fox right there? And the jay was asleep. Now where might the jay be? Oh, I think the jay is in the tree. The dog was asleep. Here's the dog right there. Can you see the dog sleeping? And the hog was asleep. And the hog looks like it's in the pen. Can you see the hog? The sheep was asleep. Here's the sheep right there. And so was the cow. Where is the cow? I think the cow is right here. Then Sam went down to the lake, but no one was there. All he could see was the moon and the shine of the moon on the water. It takes two to have fun. Who said Sam who? Who wants to play? But no one said a thing. Then Sam saw a light. He saw the light hop. He saw the light jump. It went here, it went there. It went on, it went off. But no one said a thing. Then the light hit Sam on the top of his head. The light said, boo. Who made that boo, asked Sam. Who are you? I am a firefly. My name is Gus, and I have a trick I can do with my light. Look, look. I can put it on and keep it on like this. You see how his light is on? Then Sam saw something new. The firefly made lines with his light. Say, said Sam, what a trick. This is new. Oh, the things we can do with a trick like that. Let me show you. Now put on your light and keep it on. Then you do what I do, he said to Gus. Then Sam went up and Gus went after him. When Sam went down, down went the firefly too. Where Sam went, Gus went. 
Then Sam stopped, and Gus stopped too. Now just look there, said Sam. See what we did? <gasps> Why, we made words. Big words, said Gus the Firefly. And it says, Gus and Sam. I want to do it again. This word trick is fun. Come on, make more words. So away the two went, Gus after Sam. They made lots of new words. They made fish, they made wish, they made house, and a mouse, then fox, dog, cat, yes, no, kangaroo, and thermometer. Sam and Gus made a lot more words. Then, Sam looked about. He was all alone. Where was Gus? Hmm. Then Sam looked down. He saw some cars. And there was the firefly down by the cars. Come back here, called Sam. What are you up to? What was Gus up to? Gus made some words. Gus made go fast and slow. He made go right and go left. And did those cars go? They went bash, they went smash. Gus did words that made the cars crash. Uh-oh, that is not good. Oh, what a mess those cars were in. Look at them all crashed up together. Dear me, said Sam, this will not do. Gus should not do this. Gus did a bad trick with those words. Now see here, Gus. But Gus would not see. He would not hear. He would not listen to Sam at all. Wow. Wow. I like to make words. Lots of words, he said. I like this game. Let me be, you old goose, you. And away he went. Now, do you think Gus was being very kind to Sam? I don't think so. Stop, Gus, stop. Come back, called Sam. That was a bad trick. Come back here now. Bad tricks are not fun. Oh, go on home said the firefly. You old goose, you old hen, what do you know about fun? Goodbye, and away Gus went. Now Gus did more tricks. He did word tricks on some airplanes. He made them go up. He made them go down. He made them go this way, and he made them go that way. Now, what a mess the airplanes were in. They were going in all kinds of different directions. No, Gus, no, said Sam. But Gus did not want to stop. Not yet. This was fun. Then Sam saw Gus do another bad trick. He made the, it made the firefly laugh and laugh. It was funny to see them go in free to the movie show. Gus wrote these words, come in free show. You don't need any money, you don't need any tickets, and look at all the people trying to run to the show because they did not have to pay any money. They wanted to go see the movies free. Stop your tricks, called Sam. No more words. Stop, Gus, stop. Now stop. Do you think Gus, Sam will stop? Do you think Gus will stop? But Gus the Firefly did not stop. I have one more trick, he said. A little trick. Look, Sam, look. A one word trick. And this word right here says hot dogs. 
So let's see what Gus is going to do. Gus did his little trick. He did his one word trick. He did a bad trick. He did it to the hot dog man. He made the word cold right here near the top of the hot dog stand. Nobody wants cold hot dogs. They want their hot dogs to be hot. The men looked up. They saw what Gus did. We want our hot dogs hot, not cold. Goodbye, they said. Gus did not see the hot dog man, the man with the net and the jar. Look out, called Sam. Look out, Gus. The hot dog man is mad. Look at him right there. He looks angry to me. I will get that firefly, said the hot dog man. I will take him away from here. He will not play another trick on me. Then something hit Gus. He was in a net. Then Gus the firefly was in a jar. Let me out! Gus hit at the walls of the jar. He hopped about. He jumped up and down, but it did no good. There was no way to get out of that jar. Then Gus in the jar was in a car. The car went away fast. Actually, it looks like a pickup truck to me, but in the book it says a car. Where would it take him? Would he do more tricks? Would he make more words? Would he ever get out of that jar? Would he ever have fun again with his light? Would Gus get out of the jar? Gus did not know it. But Sam was there too. Sam flying behind the truck. He was nearby in back of the car. Oh, what can I do? Said Sam. I have to get Gus out of that jar. But how? How can I get him out? Sam was sad. And Gus was sad too. I should have stopped when Sam said no. I was bad. I just had to have fun, said Gus. I wish Sam were here to get me out. The car went on. Then it stopped with a bump. It stopped on some tracks. The car would not go. The hot dog man got out. Then he looked down the tracks. What did he see? He saw a train. Look, there's the train coming down the track. Coming right down the track. Sam saw it too. What would he do? There was just one way to stop that train. Sam went to the car. He took the jar, the jar with Gus. Then he let the jar fall. Crash and Gus was out. You can stop the train. You know what to do. Do it, said Sam. And the firefly did it. He made the word stop. He did it fast and he did it big. He made the word stop. He made lots of big stops. Yeah, wow, Gus, called Sam. At last you did a good trick. Look, it says stop. Look down there, a car on the track. Stop the train. And do you see all the stops that Sam, that Gus wrote? He went one, two, three, four stops. The train did stop and just in time. What a trick, they all said. A good, good trick. Hooray for the firefly. He stopped the train. But Sam and Gus did not hear. They had gone away. There they are, flying away together. Sam looked at Gus as the sun came up. Now the morning light is here, and no one can see your tricks. It is time we went home to bed, said Sam. 
So Sam went back to his home in the tree and Gus went back to the lake. But night after night, when the moon comes up, Gus the firefly comes back to play. And here's the firefly coming and he says, get up, Sam. Can you see that? Get up, Sam. And that is the end of Sam and the firefly. I hope you liked that story. And I will read you another story in a few minutes. But now, here's a song for you all. Are you ready for this song? Get your little birdies ready. Two fingers, little birdies. I saw a little birdie go hop, hop, hop. I told that little birdie, won't you stop, stop, stop? I opened up the window to say, how do you do? And he shook his little tail and away he flew. Thank you. See you next time.